Hello everyone, in this video I will show you how to build the APK of your Android application that you can install on your phone. So let's click on build, then build bundle APK, then build APK. And now we need to wait till the end of the build. So we can see that the APK has been created correctly. And we can click on locate to find it. But here we can see that this APK is in the debug version. Now I will show you how to create the release version of the APK. So we have just to click on build, then select build variant. And here we need to change the build variant of our project. So here let's select release. And we need to wait few seconds till the end of the Gradle synchronization. And now to hide this area, we have just to click on this tab. Now let's click on build, then build bundle APK, then build APK. And now the release version of the APK has been created correctly. So let's click on locate. But here we can see that this APK is unsigned. Now I will show you how to create the signed version of your APK. So let's click on build, then generate signed bundle APK. And here we have to select APK. Now let's click on next. And here we need to create a key store file. So let's click on create a new. Then here we need to provide the path of the key store file. So let's click on this button. So here I need to create a new folder on documents. So let's find the documents folder. And now let's create a new folder under this folder. So let's click on this button. And let's call this folder my key store. Let's click on OK. And let's select this folder. So this is the new folder. Let's select it. And let's create the file. So I will call it Keystore1. Let's click on OK. And now we need to provide a password to this Keystore file. Of course, we need to confirm the password. Also, we need to create the certificate. So let's provide a name to this key so we can accept this alias which is key zero or also we can change this name. So in my case, I will accept this name. Also, I need to provide a password to this key. So here we can accept this validity duration and now we need to complete this form. Now let's click on OK, then Next, and let's select the release version, then Finish. And now the signed version of our APK has been created correctly. So let's click on Locate. So here we created the release version, so we have just to open this release folder. And here we have the release version of our APK. So it is possible to upload this APK to Google Play Store. 